Three, two, one. Hello, Violet here. Welcome back to my channel. If you are new, welcome. I make reaction videos. Today, I'm gonna to be reacting to Ariana Grande for the second time. I reacted to her video, um, what's that song goes? No Tears Left to Cry. That was my first song I ever reacted to of Ariana Grande's. This song is called The Light Is Coming and it's featuring Nicki Minaj. Anyways, I'm gonna get right into it. Let's just jump right into it. Let's just jump right into it. <laughs> guys, if you guys don't know who I'm trying to copy, I'm trying to copy Philip DeFranco. Welcome back to the Philip DeFranco Show and let's just jump into it. Let's just jump right into it. <laughs> okay, Ariana Grande. Sounds like a Starbucks drink. That's a unique beat. Hey yo, so if you wipe out, you want me. Until you have to find out this one me. And then you pinch all your bum me. Now I'm the bad guy. Call me Chun Li. She would not let this Chun Li thing go. And second of all, why does she look as if she's trying to conjure something in the middle of the night when everybody else is sleeping? That's the creepiest thing I've ever seen. It belongs to an American horror story. Like she was slipping, yo, you clumsy. Where is she? The video is really different. It's not what it you see every day. It's really dark and it's like a one shot. Like, you guys notice that? All through it, you don't really see any cuts. It's a one fluid shot and if you don't know by now, I love my one long ass takes. So this is just doing it for me right now. This girl is so pretty. Like, her face is so flawless. She looks so good. Look at that shoulder movement. Is that weed? <laughs> is that weed or is that plants? Okay, I think I'm just seeing things. This is a very unique video. That ponytail looks nice. Do you guys ever notice Ariana Grande loves doing this? <laughs> and every video, just go look at her videos. Like, she's always doing like, I know she she has like, I remember I was watching this interview where it wasn't like just like a rumor that she has like a favorite side of her face that she always shows in, in interviews. She always shows that side of her face and everything. In music videos that appears, she does the same thing. She looks so good. And her wing liners are amazing. Oh, that's so sick. That is so sick. How did they do that? What? No, I need to find out how they did that. This is such a unique video. I like it a lot. That wing liner. The light never came. That, that video was dark as hell. <laughs> I was waiting for this light to come. It did not come for that video because that video was dark. I liked it though. It was not what I was expecting from Ariana Grande. And I remember when she, when they were asking her about her new album and they're like, what should we expect? She's like, just expect the unexpected like it's not what you think it's gonna be like based on her first single which was no tears left to cry i guess people probably planted an idea of what her album was gonna be like and i remember she was she said something to the idea of pretty much don't 
put it in a box like it's not what you think it's gonna be and this video just kind of proved that because this video and this song is like so much different from no tears left to cry no tears left to cry i feel like it's more like in her in what like it's more what i'm used to from her but this is really different and i like it i love when artists are like innovative and like switch their style up and one thing I'll say is I was expecting to see more Nicki Minaj. I didn't see more Nicki Minaj, but it was a good amount. Like, it's featuring, it's featuring. It's not with Nicki Minaj. I love Ariana Grande. I know why she does. Like, it's kind of like, it's kind of like how I am. Like, when I find something that looks good in my face, I stick to it. Ariana Grande knows she looks good in high ponytails or half up, half down ponytails. And that's what she sticks to because it looks so bomb on her face. Like, she, hmm. Her face, her makeup artist, all of it, like, they just did it. They did her well in this video because she looks bomb. I have to confess, <laughs> I wasn't really paying attention too much to the lyrics, even if they're written right in front of me, because I was looking at the video really, like, I was trying to pay attention to the video. The part of the lyrics I heard a lot, though, was the repetitive part, which is, the light is coming to take back everything the darkness st stole. I think that's what it was. And I like that saying, like that's a uh, really positive saying. Overall, I'll give this song and the music video a 7 out of 10. And yeah, Nicki Minaj, I'm looking forward to her new album. I'm looking forward to the rest of Ariana Grande's album and her singles. And I can't wait to see what else they bring out. They're such cute friends. I've been seeing them all over social media together. I don't know if they're actual friends or if they're just trying to promote their singles. Because I know they have another one coming out called Bed, I think. But either way, they look cute together. They're like such an unlikely duo, not in terms of music, but in terms of like personal life relationships. Maybe it's just me, maybe it's everybody else, but they're such an unlikely duo, but I like it. So I hope they're friends in real life. I don't even know why I care. Like, how is it affecting my life? Anyways, thanks for watching, guys. That was my reaction to The Light Is Coming by Ariana Grande featuring no, um, Nicki Minaj. I was about to say Lil' Kim. Side eye. Side eye. <laughs> Featuring Nicki Minaj. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Comment down below if you have anything for me to react to and subscribe for more videos coming your way. And if you want to, you can also push that notification bell and you'll get notifications whenever I put a new video out. And I'll see you back in next time. Bye!